Hello again, everyone. Uh, Alan back again with another of my deck reviews. And what I have today is one very, very awesome deck. Uh, this deck is by Seasons Playing Cards. And this is the Magna Carta Royals deck. And just right off the bat, just take a look at this tuck box. This is absolutely amazing. Nice gold foil embossing on both sides. Very nicely done. Has a nice texture to it. So it's not just a smooth box. Actually has some texture to it. So it's really, really nice. On uh, one side of the tuck box here, you have part of a picture there. It looks just like a, I don't know, something from maybe the, uh, oh, the Renaissance era or something. And on the other side, you have another kind of piece of that, that, that picture there and I'll show you something that uh, came with this deck a little bit here in a few minutes uh, that has that also on the uh, bottom of the box it's just basically you know your copyright information distributed by seasons playing cards etc 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 on the top you have uh, seasons playing cards on the in the flap there you have uh, a little saying there it says to no one will we sell to no one will we refuse or delay right or justice nice gold foil embossing there on the tuck uh, flap as well and on the inside of the tuck case you see there looks like just some like old writing on there and you got uh, on the flaps you have MC uh, I'm assuming that's for Magna Carta so that's a quick look at the tuck box. We're gonna we're gonna set this down. I'm gonna get comfortable and we're gonna move on and we're gonna really take a good look at this deck because uh, what they say is uh, you only got one chance to make a first impression and this deck here definitely did not disappoint. Made a very wonderful first impression. Absolutely gorgeous. We're gonna take a quick peek at this. Open it up here and uh, as I was mentioning a minute ago the side of the box has uh, a picture on it and that picture is part of these two cards that come in the in the box uh, just a kind of a old-time renaissance there's a it looks like a king sitting down at this small table and he's got some paper in front of him there um, and on the bottom of this side it says changing design www.seasonsplayingcards.com on the bottom of the other one there and the backs of these are the backs of the cards themselves and we take a quick peek at this absolutely amazing detail with the gold and the white and the black it's just phenomenal magna carta on the sides there you see and the uh looks to what appear to be a couple of lions up here and hard to really make out what this is here but you just see that the the detail on this deck is unbelievable absolutely gorgeous now uh, we're going to take a look at a couple of the cards that come with it uh, you do get two jokers and they are not alike uh, one of them uh, has a looks like a, a guy on a horse here and you see the other one is a Somebody like sitting on a throne there with a couple with a staff and, and something else there. So they are uh, they are different, but very very nice. Uh, now the spade, the ace of spade pip in this deck, as you can see, is just off the charts. Absolutely beautiful with the uh, the gold in the background there. It looks like a gold seal behind the spade pip. It says seasons playing cards there, right on the bottom. And uh, you see the. Uh, the indexes on the on this deck uh, they're kind of they're kind of thin, kind of squished, and for me I like that just because for fanning you could almost show the entire deck. So you see how how nice and thin they are, and they're it's just absolutely beautiful. On this uh, on the court cards on, in this deck, I want to show this because the detail on this on these court cards is just absolutely amazing i love what they did with these ba basic in design but a lot of detail just very very clean just absolutely beautiful uh this is of course a black deck and with uh, the black deck 
there's going to be uh, issues with chipping. So that is something that, uh, I mean, I personally don't even, I'm, I'm almost afraid to use this deck just because it is such a nice deck and I, don't, of course, don't want to mess it up. I want to show you also the other aces. You can see this is the Ace of Diamonds. has a nice diamond pip there with the design. Very nice. The, uh, the clubs, same way. Turn it right side up. Take a peek at that. Absolutely awesome. Love this deck. This is just absolute artwork is what this is. And you see the Ace of Hearts there. Just absolutely beautiful. Uh, appears to have a nice um, um, air cushion kind of finish. Very smooth. Just, just a beautiful deck. And the first thing I noticed about this deck when I took it out and I was kind of messing around with it. And I was doing some spreading with it. Is just how perfect these 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 spreads come out. They're just absolutely just beautiful, absolutely amazing. Love this deck. Wonderful deck would be great for anything. Be magic, be it magic or flourishing or whatever you care to do with this deck. This is definitely going to be one that catches the eyes, one that just pops out and stands out. Absolutely beautiful. I highly recommend this deck. If you haven't picked one up, um, I would suggest picking one up. Price on this deck is, uh, they're getting more and more expensive. I Actually, I got this one at a pretty reasonable rate. It was uh, probably 15 bucks or so, I think is what I paid for this. And I'm kind of bummed now that I didn't pick up more of these than I did. Uh, just an absolute beautiful deck. Beautiful design. Uh, the durability... Could be an issue down the line with the chipping, but as far as black decks are concerned, this rates up there with the, the DeVos Blades, the Midnights, the uh, uh, the Shadow Masters by Illusionist, along with the uh, um, the Vipers and and the uh, the Black Tiger decks. The, the, this deck is just absolutely fantastic. I love it. Uh, I personally will probably pick up a couple more of these just so I can I can have a few, keep them unopened. I would imagine that the uh, the collectability of this deck is going to be very very good, just because of the uh, the artwork and the fact that uh, they're getting harder and harder to find. So I would definitely recommend picking one of these up. I love it. I'm sure you would too. It's a beautiful deck by Seasons Playing Cards. This is like I said, this is the Magna Carta. Uh, Royals deck. Grab it while you can. Uh, amazing piece to a, to a card collection. Uh, my collection definitely wouldn't be complete without it. So uh, I want to thank you for watching. Uh, please check out my channel and check out the other videos I have there as well. A lot of deck reviews, etc. Uh, do me a favor and click that like button. That'd be great. I'd very, very much appreciate that. Subscribe if you can. And I'm looking forward to doing more videos. If anybody has any suggestions, just mark them uh, down in the, uh, the comment section. If you want to see any other particular decks that you're looking to see reviewed, I'd be more than happy to take a look at it. So uh, once again, my name is Alan, and I will be talking to you soon. Later.